I was logged on this morning, so I don't know. I got kicked off. Whenever Alyssa Priest logs onto her computer. No internet secured. It's an adventure. Please check your internet connection. Try again. I check all the time. Alyssa runs a small business out of her home in rural Arlington, which she says is increasingly difficult because her internet goes down more than 50 times a day. It gets really frustrating. Uh, I don't mind paying for a service as long as I receive the service, but it just feels like money out the door. Alyssa believes Frontier has taken on more customers than its network can handle, yet her bills have actually been going up. It's like me overselling, never filling my orders but still taking their money and saying, well, you paid for it. I'm sorry, I couldn't get it out to you. Customers have logged more than 900 complaints against Frontier with the state attorney general's office over the past six years alone. Thousands more have complained across the country. Some have even launched a website, FrontierSucks.com. I can reset the modem. Sometimes that helps too, right? Alyssa would gladly switch internet providers, but feels trapped because no other companies operate in her neighborhood. Just this last week, I was on the phone for two hours and 45 minutes. It was six different phone calls with Frontier, with customer service. I got disconnected with them every time. Alyssa is left trying to figure out where the disconnect lies between Frontier and its customers. And now we have an error that comes up. Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.